Hey everyone, welcome back to another exciting video. So I have been diving into a new custom ROM on my Redmi Note 6 Pro for the past week. Today we are exploring the Pixel Experience ROM based on Android 14. So let's uncover the pros and cons together. First of all, let's check out the Android version and security patch level. So going to the setting and Redmi Note 6 Pro so as you can see here uh, it's the version of android is android 14 and if i go to android version we can see the security patch level so security patch level is february 5th 2024 so while this isn't an official rom like evolution x or refresh rom pixel experience remains quite usable everything from like wi-fi bluetooth and network connectivity is smooth sailing without any noticeable issues so as you can see here i do have my sim card here and i did try like networks wi-fi and bluetooth all those things those are working perfectly fine moving on to the display setting we do have all the necessary features here and there is nothing much extra here actually all the things what we get with aosp rom are here nothing much and if we go to like wallpaper and style we do have few features here unlike other roms they don't really include the ai wallpaper option so we do have ai wallpaper option here rather than that there is nothing much purely aosp so there is no features at all now moving on to the battery section so the battery is doing pretty well actually i haven't found any kind of issue related to the battery it is not draining and it's working perfectly fine but uh, there are few features are missing from the battery option actually so first of all uh, we are not getting any kind of um, battery ampere setting or anything like that like we get with evolution x or other roms but here we don't have anything like that but we do have like charging control option so you can control the charging uh, about scheduling or you can limit the charging so both of them is available so i think that's enough for the feature battery section feature moving to the security and privacy setting we do get both fingerprint and face unlock here and i have already enrolled face and fingerprint so the fingerprint is working perfectly fine i haven't faced any kind of issue and the fingerprint is actually one of the best i would say like better than even evolution x or drift from so it's very good and very fast and very reliable but the face unlock is also working so i have already unrolled the face unlock so as you can see recognizing and it unlocked but sometimes it miss as you know the face unlock is not that good on any rom but both of them are working perfectly fine so as for the additional features this rom sticks to the pure aosp experience offering only xiaomi's device setting for tweaking some display and vibration strength and also you will get some kind of audio amplifying uh, options here but other than that there is nothing much going on with this rom as you know pixel experience rom doesn't include any kind of feature maybe pixel experience plus do include some features but not really pixel experience rom so in terms of customization you are getting nothing here so when it comes to apps pixel rom comes preloaded with gfs eliminating the needs of uh, flashing separately there is no bloatware to clutter the things up and you can disable pre-installed gfs if you don't really want them so you can disable them rather than that there is nothing much all the application are working perfectly fine and as you can see i have already installed uh, safety net uh, check so the safety net is failed right now so you can't really use bank apps here but um, the developer said they're going to update the rom and maybe in the next update uh, the cts profile will be fixed and you can use like bank apps and other apps so as you can see it's failed other than that all the applications are working perfectly fine lastly let's talk about the camera while the rom does uh, come with a functional camera application as you can see here and it does work perfectly fine like you can take pictures and videos everything is working perfectly fine 
but there is no me camera application here and i haven't seen like experience from including me camera they never did however um, i did install the gcam i usually use that one is also working perfectly fine as you can see here no issue with the camera application everything is working fine now should you consider installing this rom or not in terms of performance and usability i haven't faced any kind of uh, major issues here actually it works flawlessly however uh, looking for the extra features like me camera support uh, those things are not available unlike evolution x and refresh rom or see droid rom and also those rom actually are a little bit better than pixel experience rom nevertheless if you still try this rom out i will put the rom link in the description below and you can try it yourself so that's all about pixel experience rom for redmi note 6 pro Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time.